Hey, y'all, and thank you for coming back to the channel. Let's get right on into it. A big, big, big congratulations to Portia and Dennis on their new baby girl. Yes, three hours ago, she gave birth to a bouncing baby girl. Yes, congratulations, Portia. Congratulations. All right, we're going to get this information straight from... What we got? What we got? Who, who am I getting this information from? Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. It's going to be by Rachel Paula Amberson and Riley Cardoza. They have written it from usmagazine.com. Breaking news, breaking news. Real Housewives of Atlanta star Portia Williams gives birth. Welcome to daughter with Dennis McKinley. It's a baby girl. It's a baby girl. Hey, hey, it's a baby girl. She was born on Friday, March 22nd, 2019. Okay. The Real Housewives of Atlanta cast just got a little bit bigger. Portia Williams, 37, and her fiancé, Dennis McKinley, welcomed their first child, a baby girl, on Friday, March 22nd, according to her sister's Instagram story. That's Lauren. Lauren is Instagramming her little fingers and palms away, telling her the good news of her niece arrival. Yes, to planet Earth. Okay. Uh, she writes, she's here. Lauren Williams wrote on uh, over a screenshot of a text message exchange with McKinley. OMG, she wrote to him. Let me see. Portia 37 confirmed her pregnancy in September. That same month, the Bravo personality announced her engagement on Instagram by flashing a 17 karat diamond ring. Yes, she's happy. She's happy and she's a mother. Yes, a mother. Portia Williams is in the hospital. Uh, before giving birth, they took a lot of little snapshots of her or her mother, I guess, on, and then Dennis' sister and his mother, I guess. I'm only guessing because I don't know. Anyway, Dennis brings out a different side of me. She gushes to U.S. in October. I'm more laid back with him, and we are just in love. Honey, want a man do it? Want a man? Want a good man do it? Okay. I see you, girl. The model broke down crying when her entrepreneur love popped the question. I wait a minute. They say a model. Okay. Portia wasn't no model. Okay, anyway, going back to their commentary. I cried the ugly cry. It wasn't even a cute cry, she told uh, uh, U.S., but McKinley was the weep weeprier one throughout the pregnancy. Yeah, he is a crybaby. Cry I've seen him in action. Okay. Then it's a little photo they give us of Lauren Williams uh, posted to her in Instagram. She's here. Oh, my gosh. Let me see. You know. Uh, and I included that Instagram little post just a few minutes ago. Okay, I thought it would be way more emotional when it came to going to the doctor and stuff. The reality star revealed in October. People are like, you'll probably cry when you see the baby. But I think all of that transferred to my husband. Okay, he's not your husband yet, boo-boo. He's not your husband yet. Hopefully, y'all are going to get them numptrals together. And before she turned one, y'all will be husband and wife. Okay. All right. Couple experienced a scare in November when Portia was admitted into the hospital for complications associated with her fibroids. At the time, a source told us she was experiencing extreme pain due to the gynecological condition, but that the baby was fine and healthy. Four months later, the mom to be celebrated her little one's impending arrival with a winter wonderland themed baby shower. Attendees included Real Housewives of Atlanta co stars, including Kenya Moore and Cynthia Bailey. There are always surprises and bumps while planning events, but I have to say I am an ama I had an amazing team behind me that really exceeded all of my expectations. The Dish Nation's co-host told us exclusively at the time. The day went better than I ever could have imagined. Portia was previously married to former NFL star. We're just going to say Stewart because we don't want to give him no shine. From 2011 to 2013, that was me. That wasn't written in the commentary. Okay, get with it. All right. And it just goes on talking about the Real Housewives of Atlanta airs on Bravo on Sunday, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Okay, let me see if I can get anybody else that want to drop us something on Portia Williams. Okay, let's see what um, 
eonline.com says, okay? They break it out. Portia Williams gives birth to her first child. They're saying the 37-year-old Real Housewives of Atlanta star gave birth to her and fiance, Dennis McKinley's first child, a baby girl on Friday. That's this Friday, okay? 22nd. The couple's daughter was born at 1.36 p.m., weighs 6 pounds and 15 ounces, and measures 20 inches long. She's going to be tall, according to people. What a time to be alive, Portia and Dennis said in a joint statement to the magazine. Portia and I are so happy and blessed to announce the arrival of our daughter, baby PJ, meaning Portia. Okay, I don't know what to do. Oh, Portia Junior. Okay. We couldn't have imagined a more magical moment. Can't thank everyone enough for joining us on this journey. It's been a fantastic journey. Her sister Lauren Williams posted on Instagram a photo of her and Portia in her hospital room, as well as a screenshot of a text message exchanging or exchanged with Dennis. He wrote, she's here. She's responded. Oh my gosh, let me see. Dennis had an earlier post, posted a picture of him and Portia sitting on her hospital bed. I also had that in my uh, commentary or my video. Uh, he said, it's going down, basement. Hashtag meet the Kenleys. Hashtag baby PJ. Hashtag milk season. Hashtag grateful. He wrote. Oh, and then it has a little. They have a little um uh, picture of Lauren laying on um uh, Portia's uh, stomach in the hospital. Okay, and Lauren O D Wheel. I guess it's her. She says waiting for my baby to have a baby. What? I didn't get to give my speech at the baby shower, so I'll give it here. When Daddy died, I was 10 and she was 16. We were at the hospital in North Carolina Duke, and the doctors had notified everyone that he probably wouldn't make it through the night, so the family gathered at the hospital to say their goodbyes. I knew why everyone was there, but for some reason, I still hadn't accepted it. The night That night, I slept in Portia's lap in a private waiting room. The next morning, we woke up and flew home. The morning of the funeral, I sat on the front row directly in front of the casket. Probably not the best idea for a 10-year-old in hindsight because they left the casket open for the majority of the service. So I laid on my Aunt Jetty's lap and went to sleep. I slept until the end of the funeral when my mom was responsible for kissing cheeks and shaking hands with guests. Portia immediately got, got grabbed me. Wait a minute. Portia immediately got grabbed me and walked me out of the funeral. She knew it was all too much for me. Her motherly instincts have always been there. She's my child and my mother. If you know us, you know what I mean. So I'm ecstatic to welcome my niece, granddaughter, second daughter, and PJ to the world today. Pray for us. Alrighty then. Then it has another little cute picture of fresh uh, Portia and him. Um... Oh, he never should wear that suit again. Oh, my Lord. I don't like that suit on him. But anyway, he got on a navy plaid suit, y'all. And it, mm -mm, it's it's not a good deal. But anyway, Portia's looking um, great as always. And her little butterfly flip-flap sandals. Um, yeah. And it says Portia has announced in September that she was pregnant with her and Dennis's first child. Six years after she suffered a miscarriage, two weeks later, she revealed that she and Dennis are engaged and showcased a more than $750,000 diamond engagement ring. Okay. I said, yes, yeah, she wrote on Instagram at the time. Matter of fact, I said, hell yes. F -O -L -L -O -L. Love you, baby. DM. I'm ready for the rest of our life. In October, Portia revealed her baby. That her baby is a girl. She started referring to her child as PJ, as in Portia um, Juniette. Okay. And that's pretty much it that they wrote, guys, with a little of my commentary in there as well. But congratulations, congratulations to mommy Portia Williams finally. Um, she always wanted that happy wedding, happy um baby happy life happy family so now it's time for her to have that wedding solidify everything and go on with the rest of her life okay but congrats again and portia all our prayers and and, and and happy thoughts and be um really glad to see some photos of the baby 
All right, y'all take care and I'll talk to y'all soon for something or another. Some kind of video might crank out again today or it might wait till Saturday. All right, but y'all enjoy y'all sales. Have a great weekend and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.